Hey, greetings class. Uh, this is uh, a module for Farmer's Market uh, for AGB 231. I'm Ray Gless and uh, this is just a, basically uh, uh, a quick information about what will be done in this module. Uh, keep in mind that Farmer's Market is really the importance of a Farmer's Market is building connections and a relationship with your customers and of course the vendors themselves. Uh, with that in mind that it's, it's about uh, what is known as the supply line from the farmer to the customer and where you actually build a relationship there and they actually know who you are and where you're from. Uh, so let's look at a checklist and of course every module has its checklist and let me just go over quickly to you what that what's involved in this checklist here will be doing. Uh, the first part you'll do you'll view a video on the farmers market uh, from outside looking in about an individual giving you a quick overview of a farmers market of how they see it. Uh, then the next two videos we'll have is from um, uh, a person named Chris Stone, who who is an urban farmer, uh, author. Um, he has given uh, workshops uh, around the United States. As a matter of fact, he did one here in Mesa uh, right before, uh, in 2020. And so he talks about how you can grow your farm, a small urban farm, uh, less than a quarter acre, and be able to produce and, and provide farmers market uh, and, and a place for you to be able to sell. Uh, so he'll talk to you about how to sell at a farmers market, some just basic points on that, uh, along with how to organize yourself pre and post before you go to the farmers market and after. And then also, uh, then the next last step is the uh, looking, we're going to look at the operations of a farmer's market uh, and developing a farmer's market event and looking at it from a point of view of, of possibly being a uh, farmer's market manager uh, or maybe an organizer that uh, what things you have to take consider to be able to put together a farmer's market. And so that will be in the, the last part of this module that you'll do. Keep in mind when you're making connections, and I use this that uh, I find, I, what I ran across was this farmer uh, who produced potatoes, he provided a, a post uh, card with uh, all his potatoes he sell at the farmer's market. And a little thing here says, your potatoes were taken from the farm less than two days ago. This freshness and quality you can only get directly from the farmers themselves. And uh, it's a, uh, it gives you the, the website that you may have information so you can find out more information about it. But also on the back of this, he also puts a more personal note on it too as well, where he says, thank you for eating potatoes, his name and the name of the farm. You know, this is more informational and this is more personal, but th this is a good example about building relationships uh, with your customers. Uh, you may not, maybe uh, this is a way that may be more informal, but yet he keeps trying to find those lines to find, build those relationships because you keep coming back for his products, right? And of course, uh, the packaging of his product, building his brand, uh, of course, you know, Idaho Potatoes, they, they built that brand for, for decades. But uh, tagging on to that, where his farm's at, uh, his bag, you know, to, uh, where it's from, uh, some interesting health points about it, uh, nutrition uh, information for potatoes. And so all this is on there, giving you a, a, a branding a, a event for you to, to branding your product with the customer. Uh, when you build your relationships, you want to look at those customers that once you make that connection, uh, a lot of times they'll follow you back to your business, either at the farmer's market or back to the business site where you grow or have it. And so a lot of times uh, people will have a, uh, uh, a, a small store on where they produce their crops. Uh, for example, out in East Mesa, uh, East, East Mark, if you get a chance to go out there, their steadfast farm out there is a good example of that where you're at the farmer's market, but he also provides a farm store on site. And also uh, they can view around and it's, it's building the East Market community where people uh, can walk around there and uh, actually see what is being grown there. And so that's an example of uh, the connection that being made at farmer's markets. 
Okay, so that's that's what we uh, this module is about. Uh, good luck, and and we'll see you again. Thanks.